Jesus is coming! down when there is systemic contradiction my name symbolized all that was corrupt to society his name symbolized all that was pure and I was being held in the embrace of a man who was pure and these inviolable sanctities were preserved in those ten words and it is the desacralization of all of these that has put us in the mess that we find ourselves. Isn't it true? Alas, it is much worse. A person may end up believing in anything. You know, if that human acceptance does so much for you and me, think of what it is when God himself puts his arms around you and says, welcome home. What love is this? It is God's love. No other love can be defined until that love has properly been understood. For Christ is coming soon. And he's coming soon. Get ready. Give your heart he's to Christ today. For his he that hath the Son of God had life. It's time to let a whole And he that hath not the Son had no life. Live a life for him. Jesus is knocking at the Christ door of your heart. On his way. Give your life to him today. I love the simplicity of the gospel message. Your debt has been paid, you're free. That's the good news. Your debt has been paid by Jesus Christ in full, who went to the cross, whose blood was shed in your stead. The A is for admit. Admit that you're a sinner in need of a savior. The Bible says all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. There is none righteous, no, not one save one, Jesus Christ. The B is for believe. Believe in your heart that Jesus Christ was crucified, buried, rose again from the dead, that Jesus is Lord. And then the C, after believing in the heart, is confessing with your mouth, calling upon the name of the Lord. Romans ten thirteen says, all who call upon the name of the Lord will be saved.